Hi students, this is a quick tutorial to use the Yale databases for your research. From the ClassLink Launchpad, where we have all of our programs, you're going to select the library folder. You have many programs. We're going to focus on the Gale today. Gale has many different databases focusing on different topics. The best one for this presidential priorities project are the high school Gale in context or the opposing viewpoints. All of the programs have the same interface and the same way to limit your searches and uh, navigate through all of the results. You can browse for issues if you don't have yours um, decided upon yet. They're in alphabetical order. I'm sure you already have yours chosen and you can enter your search term here on this basic search screen or you can choose the advanced search screen where you can add multiple search terms and limit your results. We're just going to do simple. I'm looking for climate change information. When I start typing, it brings up a whole lot of possible options that might be useful for your search. I'm going to select this first one, global warming and climate change. I forgot to mention that you should sign in with your Google account. If you do that, it'll be easy for you to save any article that you might want to use. The first article that comes up is an overview many times, um, some topics that might not come up. You could read this article in full, or you can scroll down to see the thousands of other resources. Um, unique to opposing viewpoints are the viewpoint articles. These are articles that are written by people have that have taken a decisive point of view on a particular topic and provided all of the information to back up their own point of view. Reference are like encyclopedia articles. Um, statistics have numerical information. Audio includes podcasts and interviews. There are regular trade magazines, newspaper articles, academic journals are really focused um, magazines on uh, serious topics with um, expert writers. You will definitely need video content and images for your um, presidential priorities. Let's look at an article. I'm looking at the academic journals here. There's 2,000 of them. If I wanted to limit them, there are different ways. You can do it by date or document type, the um, publication title. I definitely want something from this past year. You could enter a custom date range or just within the past year, past month, or past week. For climate change, I think the most up-to-date information is important because things change so much. Um, the different reading levels, the red is the highest for college level, purple for high school level, blue for middle school. Any of these that you wanted to choose, you open that up. And this gives you a whole lot of options. You can cite it. We'll give you the MLA 8 edition, which is the default. You can send it to your Google Drive or email it, download it, print it, or get a hot link to it. You're able to make highlights and notes of any content. Just highlight it, select your color, and add your information you to visit later. If you do that, make sure you send it to your Google Drive by hitting here or the arrow key up top, and that will save it to your Google Drive. Um, other features is you can change the font size if you like, and you can have it read to you. Um, over to the right, there are articles that are similar to the topic that you're looking at and related subject terms. Every article has the MLI citation at the very bottom as well, right there. Um, if you have any questions or need help, please reach out to Mrs. Grecht or me. Good luck.